Well, I want to begin a new series with you today on the power of convergence. You say, what is convergence? Well, in a very simple sense, convergence is when two streams or two rivers come together and they converge. They, the power and the resource of each of these streams come together to make one powerful unit, one powerful flow. And so there's other definitions of convergence, I'm sure, but for the sake of our discussion, let's just go with this idea that it's two or more things coming together. I have noticed over the last number of years that there is an awakening to the idea that that which is sacred and that which is secular, really, God never intended for those two things to be separated out. In other words, we have the business marketplace and we have the religious system or the church. And you, you belong to a church and you do the religious thing and then uh, that's on Sunday and maybe on Wednesday. Then you, you put that down for a few days and you go into the marketplace and do a separate thing. I would like to suggest to you that there's a movement that is emerging and has been for years now, but it's taking on traction and that is this that the walls are coming down between the sacred and the secular. The walls are coming down between the marketplace and what we call ministry. In fact, what I would like to suggest to you is that when one says they've been called to ministry, no longer does that necessarily mean they've been called to stand in a pulpit and preach a sermon, maybe sit in a Sunday school classroom and teach a class, maybe be an evangelist or a missionary, Maybe the, the sense internally that God is calling you to minister in some element, in some place, in some sphere, maybe ministry for you is not even in the four walls of the church. Maybe ministry for you is in the corporate boardroom of that Fortune 100 company. You see, at the end of the day, we're called to be salt and light. We are called to be change agents. We are called to actually administer and facilitate the establishing of God's kingdom in the earth. Well, we can't do that if we are isolated and hanging out just with ourselves, amongst ourselves all the time. At some point, we must be sent as sheep in the midst of wolves. We must go where light is needed in order to administer light. And I believe this convergence is happening. I believe that God is orchestrating a movement now where people are getting in touch with who they are, what their purpose is, and they're becoming all God's called them to be. And they're also being activated to go into the four corners of the earth. You see, it's really about this. We've talked for years about come out from among them and be separate. That's a verse in the Bible, and we've, we've really focused on that and made that our, our ethos. But we have to now reconcile the come out from among them with the scripture that says, go ye therefore. Somehow we've got to understand that we, we are a separate people. We're unique. We're sons of God, but we are called to go. Convergence is happening. Will you be a part of it? My name is Brian Holmes, and I hope this has encouraged you and challenged you to think differently about who you are and what God's called you to do. I look forward to talking to you again very, very soon. Thank <laughs> you.